Well, I want to welcome everyone back from the break. As you know, my name is Anthony Sequera, and this is StormWindLive.com, and we are taking a look at Interconnecting Cisco Network Devices Part 1. When we left off, we were talking about all of these great network management and network tools that are built into our Cisco devices. Now, when you look at things like Cisco Discovery Protocol, you're amazed at just how easy it is to harness the power of this particular built-in management tool. I mean, since it's enabled on most interfaces and all devices by default, we can go in and quickly generate a map of our topology thanks to this built-in tool. But unfortunately, not all of the built-in management tools in Cisco devices are this simple and straightforward. In fact, some of them, like the Embedded Event Manager, are going to require programmatic skill in order to utilize. That's where we like to turn to third-party tools. One of Stormwind Live's partners, Davra Networks, is a great example of a company that specializes in these third-party tools to make sure that our management of the network is not reactive, but it's proactive instead. I wanted to go ahead and take a moment and show off one of their products for doing this, and it's called Ruban. And Ruban is a product that will be our graphical user interface, be that graphical user front end to not only manage the network, but be real proactive in that particular management. Here you can see I'm in the network uh, visualizer. And so I'm gonna go in here to my Spain branch and in the Spain branch, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just go ahead up here and pull up a dashboard. Notice how much power we're going to have in this dashboard. And again, what I want to convey here is this is leveraging IPSLA, Embedded Event Manager, all these sophisticated tools that might require programmatic skill to use, but are just being harnessed by this great graphical user interface front end. Right away on this dashboard, notice we have some, some events that are coming in, like high memory usage, for example. One of the great things that we would want to do if we are getting one of these messages is see exactly what's causing it. And thanks to technologies like Embedded Event Manager, we can build in automation. So notice, one of the things that will automatically happen here for the network administrator is based on the high memory usage event, we'll go ahead and we'll issue a command. The, the command will be automated, and you can see that we are going to go ahead and run this particular command in order to check the memory utilization. Here we can see jitter has been detected in this particular alert, and the automated sequence of event, events is show interfaces serial, show processes memory sorted, show IP SLA monitor statistics, and show process CPU sorted. So amazingly robust proactive network management. Notice this is simply the dashboard. There is a separate reports area that I can go to for more sophisticated reporting capabilities like uh, full-blown site reports uh, based on EEM and IP SLA data. Also, of course, while we can leverage the built-in power of these particular components that Ruban builds for us, we can also go in to an area that would allow us to create custom policies. But notice one of the things that I love is they've thought about key performance uh, components, interface state, system performance, hardware issues, security config, even some more generic like syslog monitor reports and things of that nature. So 
while there are many, many sophisticated tools inside of the Cisco device, it can be very, very difficult to harness their power. Fortunately, we do have products like from our Davra networks, which are going to make it very, very easy, as easy as pointing and clicking in order to harness that power. Well, folks, we're going to take another short break. And when we return here at stormwindlive.com, we're going to jump right back into more great information in our ICND course. <laughs> 